I ever doubted the existence of God? Yes, although I'm a Christian, I would say there have definitely been times when I've doubted that God was there uh, or doubted that he existed. I would say there have been times where I've naturally wondered where God was, and say something happened, maybe something bad, um, or I was struggling with something, and naturally I started asking questions um, as to whether God was there, whether he cared or not. Let me tell you about one specific time where I doubted the existence of God, and I'll start with a bit of context. So growing up, I definitely would have called myself a Christian. Uh, my mum was a Christian, so naturally I was brought up um, going to church and um, learning about the Christian faith. I would say that I definitely experienced God for myself throughout my childhood. It was definitely my own faith as well as just my mum's. However, I never really had reason to doubt that God was there. I had a fairly okay childhood. Um, I didn't really have any big questions or reasons to kind of think about those questions. I didn't really have a reason not to believe in God, to be honest. But there came a time when I did start asking questions, where things got a bit more difficult in my life. And naturally, uh, I started asking questions like, is God actually there? And what does the Christian faith actually have to say? Um, and how does it speak into these situations? So at that point, I really did start asking questions, as I'm sure all of us do, no matter our background, what kind of faith we have, whether we were brought up in a Christian home or knowing nothing about God, we all ask these kind of questions at some point in our lives. So this particular situation that I'm gonna tell you about started um, when I was 18. Now, as a teenager, I'd spent the past few years kind of in and out of church. Um, I didn't really see how church or God was actually that relevant to me as a teenager. So I hadn't uh, been going that much. I hadn't really been particularly involved. So there came a point uh, where I found myself to have gotten quite low. I was struggling uh, with things like friendships um, and school. I was struggling with um, academically. Um, I was struggling with um, my relationships um, and yeah, struggling to kind of know what my purpose was. I felt very insignificant and small and quite a big and confusing world. I remember just thinking there has to be more to life. There has to be something else beyond what I know, beyond my bubble, beyond what I know and do at school and my friendships it's got to be something else i would say at that point i still called myself a christian um but actually in reality my faith in god um my christian faith wasn't really making much of a difference to my life i wasn't really acting on it or going to church or praying or doing any of the things that um, most christians did i remembered though that there used to be a time when i was younger when i was a child that uh, i did feel close to god and I remembered that when I was 18 and remember thinking, why isn't that the case now when actually I'm at a point where I could really use God's help, um, where I really need God at this point in my life. But actually, he feels quite far away. He doesn't feel um, close. It doesn't actually feel like he cares about me. Um, so I did actually start asking questions because I wasn't really convinced that what I'd believed growing up was entirely true. I remember thinking okay, I don't have all the answers on my own and I can't do all this on my own. So if God really is there, then I think I need him to make a difference to my life. I remember thinking if there is a God and if that God is the Christian God who loves us and cares for us and is actually at work in our lives, then actually that changes everything, doesn't it? That really should make a difference. So I decided that the Christian faith was probably worth exploring. Uh, and this time I decided that I was going to explore it in more depth and actually figure out what I thought and figure out um, some of the answers to my questions that I'd had about God, um, about whether he cared, about whether he even existed. Um, I decided to pursue that uh, and to think about it more and to find out what I thought. So after I'd made that decision, I thought, well, the only thing that I really know how to do uh, is pray. So I'm just going to try that. I'm going to try praying and see what happens. So it was really simple. Um, my prayer just became, God, if you're there, then I want you to make a difference to my life. Uh, and that was it. It was as simple as that. Um, and I just prayed that um, every time I kind of had those questions or started to doubt um, or wanted a bit of help in my life. That was my prayer. Um, and to be honest, initially, nothing changed. Absolutely nothing happened. Um, my situation very much stayed the same. Um, I was still struggling. I was still finding school hard. I still 
didn't really have many friends at this point. Um, so it, it did really feel like actually God wasn't there, um, that he didn't care if he was there. However, slowly things did actually start to change. Uh, I found my situation changing uh, really gradually. So I found myself in situations where I was becoming supported by other people uh, and I got invited back to church, to a new church that I hadn't been to before that had a lot of other people who were my age uh, who also wanted to find out more about God. Um, they weren't, it wasn't a church necessarily full of Christians, um, but full of young people who wanted uh, to find out the answers to some of the questions that I had. So that was a really good place for me to start going um, because it meant that I could um, ask questions and talk about the answers with people who didn't already have kind of set solid views. Um, and that was a really helpful time. And eventually through meeting with these people um, and going to this church and through praying more um, and being supported by the people, I started to realise that actually maybe God was really there and maybe God did have a role to play in some of the things that have started to change in my life. I realised that God is interested in the whole of my life, not just uh, the good days um, or the particular things that I'm praying about, but he is interested in everything. I realised that I can't just decide to be a Christian on the days that I fancy it. Um, it didn't really work to just be a Christian while things were going well as a child and then stop as a teenager. I kind of came to the conclusion that actually if God was there, if he was real, then uh, he's going to make a difference to the whole of my life. Off the back of that, I started making some better decisions and choices. Um, I started investing in friendships that uh, were better for me. Um, I became more motivated, I became happier, um, the kind of heaviness that I've been carrying slowly just lifted. Um, it didn't mean that all my problems went away, but things definitely started to get better. And I would say that during that time I began to experience God in new ways and in deeper ways than I had done before as a child. I would say that during that time I really discovered who Jesus was and that that made a difference to my life, that things uh, became different because of that. I think that since then I've actually come quite a lot further in my faith. It's not really based off how I feel now, it's not based off um, just what I hear someone at church say or just if I feel like God is close with me, um, but actually my faith has got a lot deeper uh, and it's got deeper through things I've learnt but also through having had experiences of God. But also I took some time to explore some of the evidence for Jesus. Um, I didn't just want to blindly accept everything, so I decided to look into some of that and to ask some other questions that I'd had about who Jesus actually was and how we can know that the Bible is reliable and how we can know uh, that what it says is trustworthy. I found things like the Alpha Course um, really helpful in helping me to kind of work through some of those questions and talk about um, things like the existence of God with other people and other kind of newish Christians um, that had similar questions to me and that was a really good opportunity to, um, to have those discussions and to find out what other people thought and also to look at some of the evidence um, that people have kind of put together for who Jesus was and um, the existence of God. So yes I would say I have doubted the existence of God but I would also say that I've only ended up with a deeper faith as a result of that. Sometimes I still do wonder why God doesn't intervene in bad situations or why difficult things happen. But actually we don't always have the answers and that's okay. What I do believe is that God is good uh, and that he's with us and that he cares about these things. <laughs>